It's because of what you're seeing right now. A storm like today means students are having to learn from home. Some low country parents, though, say they were left scrambling to find child care today. And even parents who are working from home say juggling working, parenting and teaching can be overwhelming. Live Five's Molly McBride joins us live outside of Mamie P. Whitesides Elementary School. And Molly, you talk with the parent who has children there. Well, that's right. As you can see, it's an empty campus here today. Like many Whitesides parents, Jenna Arsenault says she has her second and sixth graders learning from home today. Charleston County School District announced the switch to e-learning yesterday because of dangerous travel conditions for school buses in accordance with state policy. Arsenault tells me e-learning is something that she and her family dread. She says it's hard enough to be a working mom, but adding the responsibility of teaching her boys on top of that, that's overwhelming. And it makes me feel not good about myself that that it's a struggle and we end up sometimes in tears, um, sometimes bickering with each other and it just doesn't feel good. It's not good for our family. She says she's lucky she can work from home and recognizes that for some days like today mean looking for childcare or even missing a day of work. One mother I spoke with says it was actually especially hard to find childcare today because daycares are closed and all her typical babysitters were either doing e-learning or stuck at home. We'll hear more from her coming up in just one hour, but for now, live in Mount Pleasant, I'm Molly McBride.